It's really good though. We we would get this again, and I'm gonna enjoy snacking on this with some crackers. Yeah. And if you come over and I do a cheese board, this will probably be on the cheese. Yeah. Board. Yeah. All right, child. So um, somebody didn't change. He ain't changed his shirt with me. <laughs> nope. So if y'all don't know what we talk about, hopefully this will be the last of the videos that we've been testing different foods that we bought at our last grocery haul. So um, we we tested two other ones and we had the same clothes on. I'm still mad you got me looking crazy. And she just changed, <laughs> even though we sat here and just hit stop and then start again for the new video. Oh my God, I had to be looking crazy. Um, so now I look like I'm a bum and just wear no, the same no, shirt every day. No, I look trifling because I'm, I'm trying to fool people by changing my shirt. So, um, you know, anyway, I'm not going to not gonna over talk it. Not going to over talk it. So this is the last thing we're going to try, which is this buffalo wing hot cheddar sauce. If y'all can hopefully see that. Buffalo wing hot sauce. Cheddar, I think is what it says, right? Yeah, buffalo wing hot sauce cheddar cheese. And let's get you a good look at it. So, let's try it this way. There you go. That's the big old block. I see all the little herbs and everything in there. Um, that's, that's the peppers. Different peppers and stuff, whatever. Um, jalapeno, habanero, cayenne. Uh, what else? Oh, they ain't no pepper. That's some sauce. Um, vinegar. I guess they're done with the peppers. Okay, so yeah. So we got some jalapenos, some cayenne, and what else? And, um, what was the one I said? The first one. Cayenne, habanero, and jalapeno. There you go. Sounds good to me. And these cows were not treated with RBST, by the way. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna try this. Make sure I get you one with some pepper in it. Dang. It had a little bite. So yeah, like, how is it a hard cheese? Is it a soft cheese? Is it something in between? Yeah, it's like it's like in between. It, it is like a cheddar. Okay. I mean, I think it is just a cheddar yeah. that they infuse with these things. So, um, in case maybe my question wasn't dumb, wasn't smart, but you know. So it's like it's like a you know medium texture. Like I'm squeezing and it's starting to you see it's starting to come apart just from me squeezing it. But you see, I got some little pepper flakes in there. Really small bite. Mm. I really like this. Okay. It's got it's got some kick. So if you don't like pepper, I wouldn't play games. Mm hmm. So when I first took a bite, my thought was this is like pepper jack but with cheddar. Mm hmm But this tastes really good because of the because of the strong yeah. flavor of cheddar. Yep. Yes. And the yeah, I think it's a perfect combination. I still have heat on my tongue, on the like kind of the back of my tongue. And I eat spicy stuff. Ooh, I can, that's I, can good. I can handle that stuff. This is this is great. Wow. <laughs> it is great. You're like shocked and red, just enjoying the food and not in your head. <laughs> what did we get? We got this from ShopRite? From ShopRite. So if y'all got it's ShopRite. Yancey's fancies. Yeah. New York's artisan cheese. So yeah, y'all should get some. So this thing was $6.99. I don't know if we got a sale or not. We no, think it's no seven, sale. 7.6 ounces. So, you know, about half a pound of cheese. Yeah, you know, you're paying for fancy cheese. Yeah. So, our thing is, so, we like cheese a lot. We both love cheese. And so, what I was thinking is, every time we go to a store, we'll just try a new fancy cheese. So, this is like the first one. Yeah. And this, this I, don't, I mean, I don't even know. I, I would hate to give it a score and then... Yeah, you know, I ain't trying to give it a score. Yeah, because then you kind of lock in where you got to put everything else. Right. It's really good, though. We we would get this again, and I'm going to enjoy snacking on this with some crackers yeah. and... If you come you over and I do a cheese board, this will probably be on the cheese board. Yeah, yeah. So this will go great with... This will go good with a beet ball. Okay. This will go good with a beet ball... Or like pickles or olives or something with a with a mild vinegar beet ball. Yeah, to mild be, vinegar beet ball. Yeah, to be specific. Or some um, yeah, and then some type of I don't know carb to kind of break it up, some crackers or something. All right, so I'm really satisfied with this one. It's That's a winner. Really good. So I guess I'm gonna go change my clothes. <laughs> All right. 
We'll see y'all in the next video. And Bye, make sure you subscribe to us and comment and like and share and all the other stuff that everybody's supposed to say to try to get more views and everything. All right, y'all. Bye.